Hi everyone, today is a home makeover video. It's a short one, but a very interesting one. So this is a window in my dining space and the view outside is of the beautiful garden and the banana trees and there's a bird building a nest here. And uh, I've got my alamonda fronds coming which are pregnant with flowers on the other side. And uh, the inside not so remarkable. So the good part of this video is we are going to transform a small space into a happy spot using things that you have lying around the house. We're not going to be spending any money or investing in new pieces. The whole point of these videos is to utilize what you have and give them a makeover. So this is an old table. It was bought from an antique shop in Delhi and the glass broke some time ago and it can't be used as a table because there's no glass. So rather than leave it lying around or push it into a corner, I've used it as a sort of a stand to showcase this very beautiful teak. It's a chest. It can be used for spices. I'm using it for tea. It's a almost a 200 year old teak chest. It's a Portuguese piece. And uh, I have not polished. I don't like spit and polish on old things. I've just dry brushed it to remove the dirt. And I've given it a loving rub with some linseed oil a while ago. So it's got this little dull patina, but it's got all the scars and the character of the past. As you can see, the clasp here is broken and I've left it like that. So this space is the space that we're going to transform. And we're using some sundry things that I have lying around the house. So we're going to move in for a quick look at that. So I have an old candle stand. It is like a rose gold again with bits of paint peeling off and I'm going to leave it like that. I like these plain white candles. I don't like too much scent and overpowering aroma. And uh, I like the simplicity of the white candle and the wax dripping. It makes it real. I have this old uh, sort of a bowl. It's a crystal swan. It's over 20 years old. It belonged to my mother and was just lying in a cupboard, in a, like a trinket cupboard that I have. I just thought I'll pull it out. These are some flowers which I got from the garden. And here I have a bowl of assorted marbles that I've been collecting since I was a child. And it's again in a very beautiful crystal piece. So let's get assembling this baby together. So we're going to take this candle stand and put it here just above this so it gives a really beautiful uh, kind of a backdrop to this piece which is going to be the focus of our transformation so you have the candles you have a beautiful background you have this gorgeous tea chest and let's get going so next we are going to bring forward the crystal swan and place it here now as you can see this corner already looks pretty special now I'm just going to add this some I'm taking the so I'm taking these glass beads. So we're going to go for the whole green ones and we're going to just find spaces and drop them in. So as you can see from here you can see the green and we're just going to do a few more. This is very easy. You can just do it in 15 minutes. Just decide what you're going to do. It's important to have clarity of what you're going to do. So I'm dropping the beads in and then I'm going to pull up the flower. So just the tips are submerged. Now you can use marbles, you can use stones, you can use um, a little bit of a rock, decorative piece of rock. So, as you can see, one flower is dipped in. So, I want to bring it to the top. Yes. And here you have it. A very beautiful, so you can see the green beads. A very beautiful piece. And this corner has completely become a thing of beauty. A spot which will give you joy and make you feel happy. So, here's how easily you can transform an area of your house, a corner which you've otherwise neglected. I hope you found this useful 
and as you can see everything I've used is old and was not being used so here you have it and I hope this was fun take care and stay tuned to more such short videos and I'm gonna take this from this angle you can see it from this angle you can still see the green and the candles and it looks just wonderful take care guys and have a great week ahead